Hi there guys, my name is Samuel and today we shall be taking a look at set 71701 Kai's Fire Dragon which contains 81 pieces, 2 minifigures being Lord Garmadon with the 2 arms Kai in his legacy outfit costs £18.20 and €20 Euros, and uh, I've already said how many pieces it has and yes, so this is basically a remake of the Fire Temple because you kind of have the Fire Dragon and then you have the Temple in big quotation marks because it has the place of the sword but that's literally it in some of the same colour scheme but overall, yeah, this is the set and... Uh, um, let's just jump into it because I believe this may end up being a pretty quick review. So here you can see Kite and Lord Garmadon. Basically, these are the same minifigures removing their weapons here. You can see whilst well, we put their arms down. Here you can see their body detailing. There is Kai's, which I think is really good. And there is Garmadon's. I just, wow, that actually works a lot better if I put my hand in front of the, behind the figures here. Okay, here you can see Kai and Garmadon, which got, they've got really great printing. Garmadon's still got the movie face, I believe, which is kind of, well, not kind of, it is definitely annoying. There is Kai, but um, yeah, I don't think it's a bad face print though, to be honest. Here is that, oh, there is a bit of fluff there, but there you can see Kai and Garmadon's. And overall, yeah, I think these are, Great minifigures, definitely great for me. This is actually my first Garmadon with two arms because, uh, like I've, I think I've said before, I kind of got into Ninjago, I think, 2014 because the rebooted, I remember the rebooted sets being on shelf, but then, uh, no, sorry, I remember the rebooted sets, that's it, being on shelf, but also the final battle shelves. So for me, it was technically kind of an in-between thing. And yeah, that is kind of what it was. And here are these minifigures. And taking a look at the build of the set first, here we have the little shrine or fire temple on this little uh, base plate, this grass one, I believe is what it's meant to depict, standing the dragon back up, it will not. Here you can see this, which overall I think this is great. Here you can see this um, printed element, which that is a good thing about the four class slash junior sets. And yeah, that's kind of it. That literally is it, guys. There's not much to show on this. Here you can see it from the top and yeah that's kind of it you can see the sword and yeah kai can hold that of course but that's kind of it guys there's not really much else for this and then here you can see these little fire elements which are really cool for like kids if they want to and they can knock them over and like throw him into them and stuff like that but overall i think that's good and then if we take a look at the dragon here you can see the dragon and with the dragon if we can put the feet down here you can see he kind of stands up and there's not much to to him here you can see here is the head print from the left hand side i think that is great the printing is definitely good on that here is it from the right hand side which yeah i think that looks really awesome you've got the eyes and looking at the head i think that looks great yeah, it's kind of it for the dragon. He has his um, brick element in here, which is really cool. So it kind of um, clips in to give him that fire effect, which, there we go, it's focused in. He has that little beard tough part. And, yeah, that's kind of it, really, for uh, the head area. Here you can see the body part, and there is that leg. And here is the other leg, which is really cool. And you've got this wing on this side. There's a bit of dust there. You can see that wing there. And then that wing there, and then it's kind of got a towel here. And it's kind of got a place for Kai to sit. And that's kind of it for the dragon. If we quick, quickly clip the legs back on, which here is that element. It is quite a big piece, which I think that is kind of the main draw for um, other collect collectors like myself who are way out of this age range. Because it's kind of just, well, part of the collection. But yeah, I think the, it was really interesting because I've never had this like, piece before. And yeah, that's what Kai looks like. And yeah, that is the new Fire Dragon, which again, I can't do a review of this comparison to the other fire dragon because i don't own that set but yeah i think this looks really cool for what it is overall guys this is an okay set it's obviously nowhere near one of the best ninjago sets that is an all right thing the dragon is pretty good in my opinion well, in my opinion actually is really good but unless you're a collect ninjago collector like myself or any or a, like a young child i really wouldn't recommend it like and and uh, unless you're a mock builder well Really, even if you're a mock builder, I wouldn't recommend it. There's nothing really, like, elements that you'd need are too specific, I would say. So, yeah, really, unless you're an Ninjago collector or you're a kid, I don't, I would not recommend it. But for collectors and kids, like I've said, yep, I think it's great. But, yeah, I think it's a great set. So, thank you for watching this video, guys. Re leave a, uh, remember to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And until um, the next video, which, guys, on the day you're watching this, I'm not sure what day I'm going to upload it. I love the, I love the uh, Raider, the Jungle Raider going out uh, before or after, uh, after this as well. Because if I don't, I keep forgetting about that set. So, thank you guys for watching. And until the next video, bye for now.